taking the Fox while Pekka sticking with the, the Diddy Kong. Diddy versus Fox. <coughs> Might be evenish. Really? I don't know about this game though. Smash yeah. 4, it was Fox's favor. But this, I don't really see this matchup that often, but. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Fox gets to blow up Diddy a little bit and. And Diddy has banana. Diddy does have banana. We saw. Pekka waited like a good 30 seconds to start pulling out banana. It felt like. Pekko's just trying to find some space in which to do so, and Odyssey just playing the patient game. What a catch there by Odyssey. It's called Diddy Main Character Development. <laughs> character Development. You know, Banana isn't everything. <clears throat> and we've seen that. I've seen Pekko absolutely just demolish his uh, opponents by not really using Banana too often, or actually uh, using it very sparingly. So definitely a little bit more of an even kind of, at least player matchup, in my opinion. But character matchup, let's see. We're seeing definitely, we're seeing... Fox. Ooh, oh, wow, hello. That was such a good set of using the scary. fast fall. In the box. <gasps> okay. I thought that barrel was going to do a lot more than just kind of gently pop Fox up. Yeah, I, I, there's a lot going on there. I was not expecting that. I, I was really looking for that Odyssey's uh, setup right there on that ledge. Mm -hmm. Fast fall into da down smash. Like, hello, that was kind of smart, yeah. bro. That was good. This is how you be moving in, 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 in Smash 4, bro? <laughs> is how you be moving? Hell no. Hell no. <laughs> Ooh, just Look at gets this. Gets the drag down with like one hit of down air. Trying to get a shine spike there on the, uh, uh, the, the barrels. Tech, like the, the, the roll on the tech, uh, the tech roll. Oh, the real tech roll. Miss the banana throw. It just like hit the stage. Which means Odyssey not going to be finding too much of a punish out of that situation. Ooh, nice Tomahawk grab. Now setting Pekko up on the platform. Pekko stuck a little bit. Now Odyssey gets another ledge trap and there's situation. A and just I think Odyssey was about to do that an 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 another one of those um, down fast falls into down smash, but then realized Pekko was going to recover high anyway. So once Pekko recovered, like I think Fox up smash goes touches the, the top platform anyway. Oh no, just not. All right, gets to react to that rolling after the miss tech from Pekko. It's just been Odyssey's game right now, but right, a good I actually, recovery by Pekko. I actually got the quickest download in the world. Right? Like, first 30 seconds, and he was like, yeah, I'm good. Yeah, I got to watch you move for 30 seconds, and it's like, all right, I've, I've obtained the information. Ooh, yeah, Pekko, I think, getting a little panicked here at the ledge, throwing out the, the spot dodge grab when Odyssey's really just nowhere near. Just playing so patiently and reacting to that dash attack coming out from Pekko. All right, Barrel's going to be putting Pekko back into center stage, but Pekko just hasn't been finding many of these openings. Finally getting a grab. Big F smash. Wow, that's humongous. That's a raging monkey right there. <laughs> the way he's, he grabbed him and looked at him. It's like, what are you doing that for? Watch this. Yeah, we're definitely out smash territory. Or, oh, hello? That was up air. That was up there. I love, I love, I love the something. trade. Yeah. Mission complete. Yeah, the mission certainly was complete. That was insane. I was sweating. So, I mean, at the end of the day, Pekka was able to bring it to even stocks. So, despite that entire game feeling very Odyssey favored and momentum, you know, Pekka. Oh, I think oh, Pekka's yeah. going for forward air. Yeah, threw out the forward air to try and cover himself on landing, but ended up sticking your foot out. And. It, it, the Tozy Wozy got hit. That's simply what it was. You hate when I say that. I love it. <laughs> the, I love it. Bro, not the prehensile Tozy Wozy. <laughs> <laughs> the Tozy Wozy's come out. Look, look. The Tozy Wozy's <laughs> are out. The feet are out. And you got shambled for with up air. Bop. All right. Anyway. <laughs> Going over to game two. Uh, currently in Odyssey's favor in, uh, in terms of, you know, number of games. Right. And yeah, Pekko bringing it right back to PS2, which, you know, I, I think is good. Pekko was starting to get the momentum back in in game one, so trying to keep that going. And with an RDC, 
it's going. Odyssey with these oh. really aggressive recoveries ch chose to like recover back like directly into Peko twice. I'm not gonna lie, I thought that he was actually gonna go into the, the ledge. Mm -hmm. And I thought it's probably what Peko was missing too, because most of them typically do try to go to the ledge just for some invincibility and uh, and safer recovery options. But just going straight for it, I, I respect it. Yeah, I think especially because Odyssey did the Firefox instead of the side B, yep. that was part of what informed that mix up. But ooh, okay. some scary pressure oh, here on the platform up air. Not gonna be doing it for Odyssey quite yet. Paco gets a chance to play with some rage and potentially find the stock, but instead it's Odyssey finding the stock. Fox just a little bit faster on that up smash. Fox is so speedy. Oh my he God. is. Ooh. Three side B and two. I am absolutely loving this edge guard situation that Odyssey is just beautifully exhibiting for us today. Yeah, it just feels like once Odyssey is given like an inch on the ledge, he takes a mile. All right, using that forward air for some aerial, aerial mobility. Peko swinging a little bit too hard on that up smash means Odyssey is finding his way back into center stage. Ooh, oh, just, just slightly pushing, uh, pushing Odyssey into the banana. Yeah, good stuff by Peko, but still, you know, you've got to find this stock because Odyssey is racking up the percentage. Okay, a nice little banana conversion, but you're just setting up back the ledge, finally getting the F tilt. But Peko now at 92%, which means Odyssey could be finding the stock soon. We've seen him, you know, just pull the trigger on, on these huge kills. Yeah, I think we'd be, then he'd be fishing for a lob, you know, possibly up airs. Um, oh, I'm sorry, up there smash. Not, not up air. <laughs> Odyssey correcting you. I said, actually, it's up smash. My, my bad. My bad. <laughs> Bro hit you with the um, actually. Um, actually is exactly what he said to me. I'm sorry. Oops, cheeky little laser right there. A couple more, just, you know, keep Peko frustrated because we've seen Peko, like, trying just go to the other side of the stage to try and take some space to, you know, try and, uh, like, compose himself. Uh, but, I mean, Odyssey making sure that that's not an option right now, using those lasers. Very, very nice. I, I'm, I'm just loving Odyssey's, like, chasing uh, uh, Peko. Like, I don't think Peko, like, has gotten away with a lot of his tech, uh, tech situations. Oh, wow. Yeah, no. Oh. Very, like, it was really <laughs> difficult for Peko to get away yeah, a lot of really. times. It felt like it was either, it was either Odyssey was on top of Peko that whole time, or, like, Odyssey said, like, all right, I'll give you some space, but you're taking laser percentage for it. Although, they're happy. Good. Aw. You know what's sad, though? What? I catch a swap. For we're real.